Hey everyone, in this video we're going to cover the, the brand new Knit Selector from Cash Cow Pro. We scanned over 100 million products on Amazon to create the top 100,000 niches. And instead of looking at individual products or items, what we're doing is taking the niche and we're calculating the average of the top five products in that niche to give you a more accurate picture of how that market looks. Uh, and first of all, the very first settings uh, you need to understand is great, good, and competitive. So we're just going to remove competitive and good, and I'll explain what these terms mean in a moment. And so what we're left with is great markets. If you click on the help arrow here, it goes into great detail about what every single column here means. So you can have a more detailed explanation than this video. Uh, as well as the criteria for each one of those columns. But I'm just going to run you through the key points. So let's take BSR or reviews. Reviews is very important in understanding the competition of a niche. If there's too many reviews across the top competitors, it's going to be very hard for your product to sell. So what we've done is, this is a spelling mistake which will be fixed, is said that 0 to 500 reviews on average across the top 5 is great because you can still rank within that market. 501 to 800 is good, and 801 plus is competitive. So we've done this with all the key criteria. So for the number of units sold, if it's under 300, we don't want to look at it because it's just too low. If the price is $10, it's too low. So if any of these key criteria are too low or too competitive, it goes instantly into the competitive section. If one out of five of the main uh, criteria you, lose, you, you use to look at products is too low. Let's say the price is too low, boom, we don't want to even consider it. It goes straight into the competitive section. So products that are considered great have a good price, sell a, a decent number of units, have a, on average low number of reviews, a good average BSR, a good margin, and relatively low overall competition, yet enough sales to justify looking further. So the whole idea of this tool is to give you lots and lots of new product ideas. We've, we've created a massive list. We've got over 100,000 niches. Most people, when they're doing product research, maybe they write down 50, 100, or 200 ideas. Here, you've got over 100,000 different ones to consider. So you can scan through, go down, click on a particular product, and then see if it's something that you're interested in doing. You can see the Amazon page here instantly. Uh, and I'm just going to run you through what these key numbers mean. You can get more detail here, or you can contact us if you're still unsure what certain things mean. Um, okay, so let's start. So overall score, this is after checking each one of these individual columns, if they all add up, then it's given a great market score overall. So we're starting with keyword competition. And what we've done is we've taken this keyword skin oil, and checked if it's in the title, in the features, and in the description. Here, it's in the number one ranked product, it's not in the title. Number two ranked product, it's not in the title. Number three, it is. Number four, it isn't. So you get a quick overview of how the keyword's being used. You do need to do additional keyword research if you're considering this product, but it's a good indication uh, because if the main keyword isn't being used in the title for most products, or in the features, or in the description, then, then those products aren't going to be as competitive as those where, for example, let's take iPhone case. If you search iPhone case, it's pretty much in all the titles, features, and descriptions of all the products that come up. So this is just an indication of how frequently the keyword's being used to give you an idea of the competition. Okay, next column, monthly ROI. So this is basically, if you buy $10,000 of this product and you sell $20,000, what this is showing you is how much percentage profit how much return on investment you're making for your investment into the product in the first place. Monthly cash flow shows you how much, on average, the top five products are making per month in net profit. That means after taking out FBA fees, after taking out the product cost and the freight cost, they're left with an estimate of $5,760 in profit per month each for each one of the top five. Okay, next units. The average of the top five products here for skin oil, let's have a quick look, skin oil. They sell an average of 2,194 units each. That means there's over 10,000 units being sold per month of the top five products in that niche. Great, fantastic. 
and what we do to calculate the sales is simply the number of units sold on average by the average price to give us the average sales. Okay, and then the net per unit is how much margin we expect per unit. You can click on any of these numbers and you'll get a full breakdown of the cost. So the average price is 1627. The average FBA fees for these products is 859, which is high, and the gross revenue per unit after FBA fees 768. Take away the product itself cost gives us $2.63 or 16% profit margin. These are just indications. You may find a supplier that's slightly higher. You may find a supplier that's slightly lower. We're using average of the top five because it gives you a really quick overview of all of these hundreds of thousands of markets that we've scanned. Estimated freight, this is from China for C and Air, and we factor that into this, this pricing and the profits um, and to give you a landed cost. And the landed cost is basically what we estimate the factory cost of the product to be plus the cheaper of air or sea freight, because obviously over the long term, you're going to use whichever one's cheaper. So in this case, the product landed cost is 332 plus the, in the C cost gives us $5 a unit approximately. Then we have the BSR. This is the average of the top five. That is 1924, which is fantastic. The number of reviews, 122, with an average score of 4.7. So the, the quality of the products is pretty high here. So as you can see, overall, this gives you a really quick snapshot of this market. And there's hundreds of thousands of these products for you to look through. There's, there's absolutely thousands and thousands, tens of thousands of ideas that are considered great and good. We have well over 100,000 products that you can scan through. So you should get idea after idea for stuff you've never considered. Don't These numbers, some of them, because they're based on the average of the top five, and we calculate these numbers uh, every two weeks, the, some of the numbers may have shifted a little. The idea of the numbers is just to give you a quick indication of whether the product's good or not, and then you can investigate further. We've scanned the 100 million products. We've filtered out all the trash for you. We've left you with the diamonds, and now you just need to sort through the diamonds and decide which diamond you want to go with first or which, which ones you want to add to your products. And in additional videos, we'll cover how to use these other tabs within the, the niche selector. I'll give you a very quick overview. You can save this product skin oil, and it will go to your potential products. And then the competition matrix, the competition summary, the my potential products and ROI analysis give you additional ways to look at the same item. Uh, simply by clicking more, it will start to take you through these different tabs with different views. So you can see it's the same data presented differently. So you can see exactly what's going on in a particular market, investigate further and decide if this is something you want to do. So just another view of the same product. And then you can take that saved in your potential products. And you can do a full return on investment analysis and cash flow over the 12 months using the ROI analysis. The knit selector and these additional tabs is e extremely powerful. You do need to just sit down and browse through the different products here and begin to investigate them. But we have saved you a huge amount of time by filtering out all the trash.